Here with Coach Donald Pickett as the Lady Demons starting conference play this week. We've been building towards this all season, and uh, we'll talk about HBU weekend in a second. But, Coach, recap for me if you can this past week uh, the entire deal, Jackson State, the, the, the four games there, in, or the five games, four games in Memphis. Um, five and one, really, and we talked, and you talked about get, wanting a response from the girls after that Houston series and felt like you really got that. Yeah, I thought we did a really good job. I mean, we had some tough games there where we made some mistakes, but I thought we kept playing, kept fighting, and, and you know, was able to pull those games out. Um, I think that's a big step in the right direction for us, and being young, being able to handle when things don't go our way, be able to keep playing. And uh, I thought the girls did a really, really great job, you know, during that time, and, and was able to, you know, do some really, really good things uh, last week heading into this weekend. Offensively, uh, ten hits or more in, in five of the six games. Would probably would have had ten if you hadn't run ruled uh, East Tennessee there. How good is it to see the offense kind of just really kind of flip the switch almost from one week to the next? Well, it's been really good. I mean, I think we've seen it starting to cut, turn in Youngsville a few weeks ago, and you know we we put some runs on the board down in Houston. We just was, wasn't able to hold them down, but um, and then. You know, last week we did a really, really good job, and thought we did. Uh, we got some pr production from the mid, like from six to nine in the lineup, which was really, really big for us. And uh, you know, I think those kids are really, you know, stepping up for us and doing a great job there. And hopefully, continue to do that to where we can, you know, have a more balanced uh, attack on offense and and do some different things. But uh, you know, I, there's a lot of kids hitting the ball that we knew, knew they could hit and you know everybody struggles at times and uh, hopefully you know we're getting hot at the right time. Yeah. You mentioned the long ball we had uh, obviously Keeley's grand slam McKenzie hit a three run home run in the same game and uh, Lanny Keats just kind of a little bit kind of quietly just doing her thing uh, she's back over 350 I think uh, average wise and just and we've talked about it before the home runs are certainly a part of it and when you have good at bats it happens but taking advantage when you have runners on we've been able to do that uh, uh, in a big way too yeah and I think that's just you know from one through nine being more consistent and, and you know not leaving those runners out there and uh, being able to put those you know more than one run in inning up is huge for us and if we do make a mistake then you know we're still in the game but um, you know we they, they've done a really good job and uh, you know I, I'm confident in our in our players and our hitters and I think they're going to get it done and now it's just you know hopefully we'll put all three phases we've we've looked good on all three phases at different times of the year and and now we're you know about the midway point of the season a little bit maybe just a little bit more and uh you know hopefully we'll put it all together talk about the the pitching staff uh, for me real quick uh obviously Bronte's been really kind of really come back along strong the past couple weeks uh still getting some good performances but uh you mentioned it a couple instances where you know not quite where the maybe the standard has been set from earlier in the season for them yeah i think uh you know we they got off to a great start i mean you know but you couldn't ask for no better yeah. start really and you know they, they were on top of their game coming in and you know i think you know obviously you know scouting reports and, and film come out on, on people and it makes it a little tougher but um i think we're just trying to be a little bit too perfect after that great start trying to keep that up at that level and, you know, and I'm, I'm glad for the kids wanting to compete and do that, but they just got to trust it. And uh, they're good enough to make it happen. And they don't have to get all, you know, into, you know, I've got to strike everybody out or, you know, I, I want to, you know, try to throw a shutout every game. We don't need to get wrapped up into that. We just need to go to the next pitch and be the best we can. And if we are, then, you know, they're going to keep us in a lot of ball games and have chances to win. Talk to me about Houston Baptist. Uh, what are you seeing from them uh, so far this year? Well, they, they you know, seem like they're get, you're getting stronger every year, and you know they're they've beat some really really good teams, and um, you know they're always very competitive, um, you know, and, and you know they, it's not easy to go, uh, you know, and win a series against that team, and um, you know especially on the road opening weekend, and you know they got you know some really good offensive players, and uh, that we're going to have to you know try to keep off base and. Um, you know, keep in the park, but uh, hopefully, you know, we can do that and we can continue to build on what we're doing and, um, you know, make the plays that we need to make. And, um, you know, it's, it's just conference week is weekends are different. And, uh, you know, we just got to keep, keep continue to do what we do and not change how we play. 
and it, it kind of goes without saying, but uh, I'll, I'll say it anyway. Uh, first series, always important to get off to a good start and, and, and set the stage for the rest of the season. Oh yeah, I mean, I, I think you know every every weekend is so important. Uh, each each and every game so important for seedings at the end, and um, you know you know sometimes when you let games get away early, it comes back to bite you later. But uh, you know hopefully we'll we'll get off to that good start and and you know continue to build on what we're doing and and you know get rolling at the right time. Yep. All right, thanks so much, Coach. Thanks.